Ukrainian forces on verge of breakthrough of Russian defense. Commander-in-chief of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, Valery Zaluzny, has told U.S. officials that Ukrainian forces are on the cusp of a breakthrough in the counter-offensive. The Wall Street Journal reported this, citing an unnamed U.S. official. It isn't too late for Ukraine to make gains, according to U.S. officials. Ukrainian commanders also say that time hasn't yet run out on their counter-offensive and Zaluzny has told U.S. officials his forces are on the cusp of a breakthrough, the publication said. The Wall Street Journal reported that Ukrainian and U.S. officials have been engaged in an intense behind-the-scenes debate for weeks over the strategy and tactics for reviving Kyiv's slow-moving counter-offensive. U.S. military officials have been urging their Ukrainian counterparts to concentrate their forces to try to break through Russian defenses and push to the Sea of Azov. According to the publication, Kyiv has made some adjustments in recent weeks, but the two sides are still at odds about how to turn the tables on the Russians in the limited time they have before winter sets in. The advice offered by U.S. officials is based on the assumption that the more than 43 billion U.S. dollars in weapons the U.S. has provided to Ukraine is sufficient for this offensive, but is unlikely to be renewed at the same level next year. We built up this mountain of steel for the counter-offensive. We can't do that again. This opportunity doesn't exist, one former U.S. official said. Meanwhile, Zaluzny stressed that this war was not a counter-insurgency. This is Kursk, he said, referring to the major World War II battle between Germany and the Soviet Union. After U.S. officials warned Ukrainian military commanders against scattering their efforts, the Ukrainians adjusted their strategy and shifted to defending the eastern part of Zaporizhia Oblast. This shift allowed them to preserve their forces for a major offensive elsewhere and to limit the use of artillery. But U.S. officials say Ukrainian forces are still too dispersed for a concentrated effort offensive to the south with numerous brigades deployed in the east. They also think the Ukrainians are still not combining the use of artillery, mechanized units and mine-clearing efforts effectively.